When I left school at the age of 18, I knew more about the curriculum than I knew about myself. Led by perfectionism and the fragrance of an A, I was swept up in its promise that I would be an adult when I left. But this industrialist model is numbed efficiency. We're working in factories, had our activities broken up by bells that I was lulled into the routine of rote memorization. So as I walk into a job interview, they ask, what are your strengths? And I say, I can recite the first 13 numbers of pi. <laughs> Education feels misunderstood. School tells us that the answers to our questions can be found in the back of a textbook, but to save our burning questions for after class. It seems ironic that at 18, I couldn't finish an essay on time, equated poetry to old white men, couldn't find the right rhymes, couldn't feel the music underneath, so naturally, I became a teacher. I realise unsustainable in existence where we teach through standardisation, trying to fit diamonds into square blocks where we work against a system, shepherding students like cattle, some sprinting to keep up, but another slowing down with a yawn. A system that decided mastery of knowledge is overrated and to move on to walking when we haven't even learned how to crawl. It seems school is indoctrination when knowledge is standardised regurgitation and sure, we have creativity, but under the chains of an HSC. <laughs> Our goal should not be to make conformists, but creators, fueled by critical thinking, lateral thinkers, so all the misfits, outcasts who didn't fit into the mould, the system should see your unrestricted potential, that difference means brilliance, and that be education. <laughs>